So if you have HPV, you may want to use DIM. Now, what the heck is DIM and what is HPV? Human papillomavirus. And then we have DIM, which is this really long word that describes a compound in cruciferous vegetables. Okay. Now, the question is, why do they use this DIM and what does it actually do? Well, certain phytonutrients are very unstable, so it's really hard to put them in a supplement. And so this actually then converts into this right here, which is much more stable and you can dehydrate it and you can use it in a supplement. It's really good for people that have estrogen dominant issues. Okay. So I've done all the videos on it, but today I'm going to talk about what it can do uh, for human papillomavirus. Now, I don't know if you know this or not, but 80% of sexually active adults have been exposed to this virus. So this is a lot more common than you might think. In fact, HPV is the most common STD, sexually transmitted disease. And it is the cause of cervical dysplasia, which is abnormal cells of the cervix. It can trigger breast cancer, genital warts, and cancer of the throat, the mouth, and the tonsils. So what's interesting about this is you have the National Cancer Institute is doing some hardcore research on DIM treating HPV with seems to be some really good results. Now you're probably wondering where do you get these ideas, Dr. Berg, for these videos? Well, actually this came from a patent. Okay. I spent a lot of time studying patents because they have a lot of great summarized data right there on various remedies and they have all the research there. So it can help to kind of consolidate everything in one document so I can actually get interesting uh, relationships and connections with various remedies. So apparently someone is doing a patent on using this for that, but they're not just including these positive effects. They're also including some interesting research that shows a potential improvement for other types of herpes infections, like the ones that create cold sores and shingles. So if you have a cold sore or you get shingles, you may want to try this as a remedy. So anyway, I wanted to create this video on another reason why cruciferous vegetables can help you with things that go well beyond just detoxification of your liver. They can help to dismantle the effects of certain viruses and lower your risk of getting cancer and warts and, and other issues. All right. Thanks for watching. Before you go real quick, I have a course entitled how to bulletproof your immune system. It's a free course. I want you to take it. And here's why. Here's you. Here is your environment. Everyone is focused on this over here, avoiding your environment. But what about here? What about strengthening your immune system? That's what's missing. This course will show you how to bulletproof yourself. And so you can tolerate and resist your environment much better by strengthening your own immune system. I put a link down in the description right down below. Check it out and get signed up today. Hey, before